Welcome back in the kitchen one more time with Chef Ricardo cooking program. Today we want to show you can make yourself a nice, lovely French toast at home, guys. This recipe is one of one of the basic, simple recipe in the world. I make it very easy for you guys. That's you guys can make this one at home. Very easy and quick and simple. So let's go into business with this French toast. You can do this at home. So first of all, what we're gonna do? One. Two teaspoon of sugar. That's teaspoon. Lovely and nice. Then what we're gonna simply do? We're gonna put. Cause I'm not gonna make a lot of French toast. It's only two pieces of bread I'm gonna do. So, half cups of milk inside of it. I'm not measuring, but half cups of milk and two teaspoon of sugar. Um, I got some mixed spice. I'm gonna put quarter teaspoon of mixed spice and a pinch of cinnamon and teaspoon of vanilla. Lovely and nice. So basically, guys, this is a easiest recipe ever in this whole wide world. So now what we're gonna do. I'm gonna put one egg inside of it. Make sure you always break an egg and check it if it is good. Pour it straight inside of it. And now you're gonna simply give it a whisk like this. One of the easiest French toasts you could ever make in this old wide world from Chef Ricardo. So hopefully you guys will like the recipe. Can you use two eggs? But I'm not making a lot as I said before. Nice and lovely. So that is finished. Uh, basically what we're going to do, I'm going to get two slices of bread. You can use your favorite bread where you like, but I'm going to use some. You can use broad bread, white bread, whatever bread you like. But I'm going to use my favorite bread I love to use. That's two slices of bread. So what we're gonna do now, I'm gonna put the stove, I'm gonna turn on the stove to the front pan to get it warm. Nice, I love it. I got a medium sized front pot right here. Roughly two to three minutes now since I have it on on the stove. So basically, I just pop a little bit of vegetable oil inside of it. You can use butter if you do like. So basically, I'm just gonna simple rub the oil around inside of it. Be careful, don't burn yourself. Then simple next is to dip the bread, the bread into the milk and the sugar. And simple. Fry it like this about two to three minutes. So as I can see, I just been over to the other side. Looking lovely so far. Looking lovely and nice. So this one is finished now. Now we're gonna take out this one as I can see. It's looking lovely and nice. So let's rub a little bit more oil inside of it. Just a pinch of oil, guys. No, not too much oil. You can use butter if you do like, but um Basically, I'm just using a little bit of olive oil, um, vegetable oil, guys. It moves free, free little for me. I don't know about you guys, but I like to just use. So as you can see, what I'm doing right here. Then take it out. Nice and lovely. Then know what we're gonna do now. I'm just gonna dip the next one. Nice and lovely. So this is the last one. This is finished now, as you can see. Looking lovely and nice. I'm gonna take it out. Now we're gonna shear it out and show you guys the next to do. Lovely and nice. So right here, this is a French toast. The best in the world from Chef Ricardo. Basically, just cutting into half like this. 
and right in here I just get a little bit of sugar and some mixed spice to sprinkle on top of it let's get a little pinch of sugar and a pinch of mixed spice and just mix it together to sprinkle on top of it get the plate and serve it to your guests just like this the best in the world from Chef Ricardo so guys as I can see French toast for breakfast say good morning to everyone we love you guys and that's why we always give you the best what we can sprinkle a little bit of the cinnamon and sugar on top of it nice and lovely so guys enjoy the recipe subscribe to the channel thank you so much for watching Chef Ricardo cooking program if you love my French toast recipe which is the best in the world Please subscribe to the channel and leave your comments. Thank you so much and see you next time. Bye-bye.